There's a big separation of uh, people in camp. The uh, uh, under high school, I would say, are, uh, had uh, good memories of camp. And you see that in the reunions. So the reunions of the camp of uh, 1945 graduates are the biggest in all the camps. You'll see that uh, even today. So it means that all of those people remember and want to get together. Uh, the 40, 46 graduates, a little bit less, that's my age, and uh, 47 graduates almost have no reunions. That's like my younger brother, because uh, maybe they were too young. <laughs> but still, uh, I think it's true that uh, the children uh, had a lot of people to play with, <laughs> and I was constantly playing. Uh, so over um, high school, this is where it cuts, where people uh, have, I'm sure, suffered and uh, have been disadvantaged by the uh, camp. They, their careers were interrupted, their studies interrupted. And uh, so either they had to get out of camp and try to go to school somewhere, or if they stayed in camp, they would, I'm sure it was not good for them. And then the older people, like my parents, who had a business, uh, they had to suffer a lot because they lost the business. They were living in these uh, very small rooms and uh, deprived of everything that they really had. So they don't have their own kitchen, <laughs> their own bathroom they don't have. So I'm sure they suffered. And uh, as I say, being a younger child, I didn't, I wasn't aware of that too much.